This weekend, Festival Australia has come to the Bungendore Country Music Festival. Beautiful historic Royal Hotel in the background. It's just hot enough for a cold beer before we go on up to the muster to see what's going on. It's full of dirt and heaven fun, throwing scrubbers by the tail mate just to show you how it's done. Good, tell us about what's going on here, Maddie. Bungendore is a bit of a find, actually. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with the setup. It looks like a bit of a setup where people know what's going on, what's what, who's who, and what they're doing. The, the, the music is fantastic, and if you don't feel like getting up in the morning, you can just lie in bed and listen to this music. Oh, Well, let me tell you the story of Joe Palmer's ghost. Joe Palmer was a duffer in the night. So come on, you bowling stockman, this challenge has to go. To anyone from anywhere. Abrasions and a nasty state of shock. Still clinging tightly to the road, I fell towards the ground And I landed on the broken bridge, the barrel had scattered round Some money for the, for the local troop guys, so to, tell, us, tell us about that and what that involves Well, we're selling ice creams to raise money Okay, and have you sold lots of ice creams? Yeah, we've sold a few I think it's about 10 to 1, we've sold 10 and they've eaten one my name's Lynn Giles and I belong to the Bungendore Community Aid, which is Buckton's in Bungendore. And we man this store every year. We take it in two hourly shifts and the money goes back into the community through the muster organisers. And we, what are we selling here? We've got, we got t-shirts? Uh, we've, we've got, got t-shirts and badges and mugs and everything's got an insignia on it to do. And each year we get new stock in. So the insignia, the insignia changes each year, the design? Uh, basically it always says Bungendore Community Muster, but it might be done in a different format each okay. year. Okay, so collector's items? Could be, yeah. Absolutely, or it could yeah. be a market for eBay in the future. Yeah, yeah totally. There's a bed on the way in the sky, Lord, in the sky. I was standing there. And the dog on the Gandhi line 
From the wildflower state of Western Australia. Finished amazing grazing, put the bagpipes back in the car. And one grave digger said the other, well I've never seen anything like that before and I've been putting in septic tanks for 30 years. <laughs> so that's the reason why I'm not playing the pipes. And um, yeah, this one's called Winter Winds. Just something I'm so grateful for. And uh, this was written by a fellow called Merv Moulton from Warwick and uh, it's just all about a man's inner longing to go back out to the Queensland Channel country which is a magical place and uh, this is just called Channel Country Ground. Did you see the pelican? Where are you from and where are you going and what brings you out here? You got the look of someone from the land. The old man raised his glass and then his rusty throat he cleared. I've come back here to where it all began. I need to taste the muddy waters of the Wilson. If you never See the sunset last forever And you've never bought a billy on fire for a cup of tea Twas the bold Ben Hall Rode into town Through the cold grey dawn With the shutters down Okay, we're here, we're talking to Boo, and now he tells me he's been coming to the festival for 10 years now. 10 years, that's right. What, 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 what brings you back year after year? It's uh, music to people, love the uh, melodies, love the atmosphere, love the camping, great place. So, so what would you say to anybody, I mean there's a lot of people out there who have not experienced uh, such wonderful traditional country music. Get up, get up on the asses and do it. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Great place to come to, you will enjoy it. You'll meet the nicest of people in Australia. Sometimes.